ongoing migrant crisis continuing to strain emergency shelters in Massachusetts. Now the Biden administration is moving to grant temporary legal status to hundreds of thousands of Venezuelans so they can work. I appreciate the president's actions, but it's not enough. We need uh, look. I, we need work permits, work authorizations. We've got to speed that up. Governor Maura Healy not satisfied. The president's decision affects nearly half a million Venezuelans already in the country. They can live and work here legally for 18 months without fear of being deported. But the governor wants others to have that chance as well. It's just not going to be enough to do what we need to do here in Massachusetts. We've got people who are coming from um, a number of countries. In Massachusetts, 6,535 families are staying in emergency shelters. That's 22,000 individuals. The Healy administration estimates about half are migrants. They're staying in hotels and motels in dozens of cities and towns across the state. She and other governors becoming increasingly outspoken, urging more federal action. Well, we've certainly been forceful in our advocacy and a number of us are weighing in. Now, Massachusetts does have a right to shelter law, the only state in the country with a law like it. Essentially, it says that families are allowed to be given emergency shelter. We're live here in Framingham, Charmin's Kitty, WCVB News Center 5.